Houston coverage continues with Channel 2's Taisha Walker. She is live in downtown Houston tonight with reaction to today's news. Taisha. See on prayers for the former first lady and the entire Bush family have been coming in from all over. I've been talking to people here in downtown Houston, not just people who are native Texans, but also visitors here from California, also from Canada, all of them telling me that they are thinking of the first lady and wishing her well in these next steps. Now, we did talk to some people who tell me that their fondest memories of Mrs. Mrs. Bush has been what she has represented represented for the state of Texas and the country during her years as first lady from her frankness to her passion for reading. Many say the billion plus dollars she helped raise for literacy post White House truly speaks to her character. A lot of people telling me today she and her entire family will be in their thoughts and their prayers. Oh, definitely our condolences. We wish, you know, the family all the blessings that they've been able to provide for the country through their service. I don't just think she was a great first lady. I really enjoyed her as first lady and she was uh, really spoke from the hip. I really liked her. I love everything that I know about Miss Barbara and Mr. George. I love to hear all the good things that they do for the city. And I'm very sad to hear that she's not doing so well. During tough times like this for the city, the sentiment has always been Houston strong, and they tell me that's the sentiment today. Reporting live downtown, I'm Taisha Walker for KPRC Channel 2 News.